Aviation is a very cyclical industry. We've seen it after 9-11, the recession in 2008, and most recently the pandemic. My mission here at the Cashflow on the Fly podcast is to arm pilots with all the tools and knowledge they need to achieve financial freedom through real estate. This is your host, Satch Bernhardt, and I hope you enjoy it. Hey, welcome to another episode on Cashflow on the Fly podcast. This is just a solo episode, and I wanted to address how can pilots become for load resistant? Listen, the truth is you can't control what the airline is going to do, right? You can't tell them, no, you won't furlough me. If they're going to furlough you, that's what's going to happen. But what you can do, though, is start preparing for that being a possibility in your airline career somewhere along the way. You know the running joke, right? You're not a real airline pilot unless you've been divorced three times and furloughed twice or maybe vice versa. But the point is, it's a very probable scenario that you will get furloughed. I don't know if you know my story. I used to fly for Express Jet Airlines and... Back in 2020, during the pandemic, we shut down. And so obviously I was, I guess I was originally for load. So it's a reality. I thought it will never happen to me. And it did happen. We were, I don't know, for those of you that may not remember, ExpressJet Airlines was one of those airlines that we used to think that we were the best. We were pretty big and we thought nothing could take us down. And so we did in fact go down. So having said that, the biggest mistake I see people make, and I, I want to help you not make that mistake is that when things are going very well, which right now, as of this recording, which is October of 2022, the airlines are looking awesome. Everyone is becoming a pilot because pay rates are going up and everyone wants to start earning some of that income. And so everything was looking great. And What happens is that when things are going very, very well, people tend to forget about the bad stuff, right? And then you forget about uh, the possibility of getting furloughed. You forget about the possibility of you losing your medical. You forget about all these bad things that can potentially happen. And people let their guards down. Pilots let their guards down. So I'm here to remind you to not do that because it may happen again, right? It happened in 9-11, it happened in 2008, it happened in the pandemic, the aviation industry went into a downturn and a lot of people, a lot of pilots suffered. So if you can get yourself into opportunities where you start generating passive income and delaying the gratification of making good money for later, you can have a very successful aviation career, even though you get furloughed you will not be suffering like many people will be because you took care of your financial situation. So focus on that, focus on that first. And especially now that times are going very, very well, instead of blowing all that money away, use it wisely and prepare for the future. Once you have enough passive income to cover your your lifestyle expenses, then shit, do whatever you want after that. I hope you like this message and we'll see you soon. If you want to never miss another one of your kids practice games, spend more time with your family, or simply do more of what you really like to do aside from flying, grab my book where I explain in detail everything you need to know to make this a reality. Go to burnhardcapital.net forward slash ebook and download my book. It's completely free and I hope you like it.